Okay guys, welcome back to another tutorial by me. This time we're going to work with Doom Builder 2. And we're going to learn how to do high res textures. So let me give you an example of that. Okay, go to visual mode. Okay. Uh, turn the highlight off and it's a high res texture right here. Okay. Now let me show you how that looks in gameplay. As you see, high res textures. Okay, some pictures that come out as great as they should, but I guess it depends on the picture because the color, as you can see, color's not that great, but it still looks pretty damn good. I mean, this one came out fantastic right here. You know, of course, it's going to be pixelated when you go up close, but I mean, look at that. Came out fantastic. I might do a tutorial about that later. And, see? Okay, enough of that. Close this out because we're not going to need it. No. Okay, now what you're going to need is a software called Slump. And I'm going to put the download link in the description so you don't have to worry about it. Okay, but first we're going to need an image. Okay, and I chose this image. I already have it saved so I don't have to worry about it. Okay, usually when you download an image online, it's going to be either a JPEG, a GIF, or a PNG, or a bitmap, but in this case it was a JPEG. I need it to be a PNG because Doom always works with PNG. It doesn't work with really anything else besides sprites, and so to do that, you need another software called InframeView. I think that's how you say it. So I'll put a down link in the description as well. Okay, you go to image, resize and resample if you want to change the size, any if it's too damn big or whatever. 500 is always a pretty good size, you know, for the width. Oh, actually, yeah, you know, also for the height. The height is a good size too. Or, you know, a little bit bigger, like say 800. It's okay too. You don't want to go like crazy, like like over a thousand, you know, really high def. I mean, you could probably mess with that and still work, but, you know, I don't know. It's a good size it is right now, so I'm not gonna mess with it. Go file, save as original folder. I'm gonna call this something called Fallout One, and I'm gonna put it as a PNG, which is Portable Network Graphic. Okay, okay, save. Okay, have it. Okay, this is the old JPEG. I'm just gonna delete it because I don't need it. And now I got this. Okay, now I'm gonna go to Slump. Make sure nothing's open. Okay, go to slump. Create a new slump or a new file, whatever. Okay, now go to lump, new from file, and click follow. Okay, here it is. Here's the image that, I, that I'm going to use for high res texture. Right click, go to add to texture one. Okay, go down, and there it is. But I'm going to scale this down to 32. But 32, okay, click on something, yes, okay, now we're going to need something now, pay attention, go to file, or no, go to lump, new, call this, all capitalized, textures, okay, press okay, now, we're going to need this code right here, which I got from um, Doom World forms, and we'll copy this. I'll put this in the video link description as well. Or just video description. Okay. Now, we're going to have to change these two right here to what the uh, texture is going to be called. Which is called Fallout 1. At least that's what mine called. I don't know what you're going to call yours. Fallout 1. Okay, now this is important too. This is the size of it. So, I'm going to go back to the folder. And my size is 387 by 500. So I'm going to change that. 387 by 500. Okay, now the X scale and Y scale is important too. You might have to come back and mess with it for the certain size you want. Usually 5 works for me, depending. So I'm going to save that. Okay, and I'm done with this, so I'm going to save it. Yes. 
I'm gonna call this Fallout. Okay, now I'm gonna go back to Doom Builder. Make a new map. And I'm actually gonna put this as skull tag, Doom in hexa format. It should work with everything else like Z Doom and all that stuff. I just choose Skull Doom, Doom in hexa format because that's my favorite format and I like using skull tag. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna go to add resources because Doom was already selected, so I don't have to worry about that. Put Fallout in. Of course, you can merge these. Right now, I'm not gonna worry about merging because it's not a finished wad, anyways. It's probably never gonna be a finished wad because I don't need this stuff. Okay, I'm gonna draw a map here or a room specifically. Okay, there you go. Now, I'm actually gonna put a player start here. Drag that. Now, I gotta zoom in, make the graph bigger, of course. Or smaller, whatever. And want the draw right here. The line. Ooh, too big, too big. I think it's a hundred. Okay. And I'm gonna put the thing. Of course, it's already called Fallout, so I have to worry about finding it. Okay. Oh, well, you see. Gotta resize it some more. That looks pretty good right there, actually. So, put my highlight on so I can see it. Click it. Put it down a bit. Okay. Clear. Okay. As you can see, um, goes per goes with the room you know the, the worry about replacing this texture it just added this so I'm gonna show you how it looks like a gameplay see here's the room and here's the thing don't look too bad probably not as great as the picture but I think that's just how the picture is so yeah that's that's how you of course this was probably not the greatest picture you know, you see the Y at the bottom. It's pretty much just like a poster you have for a room or something. So, yeah, that's, that's pretty much how you do high-res textures. So, leave this. So, make sure you want this code. I mean, world planning is perfect. I mean, this this code right here is pretty much, or not code, script is what you need in order to do this so it doesn't mess up and shit. So, you know, hope this has been a formal informal what the hell am i saying um hope this was you know good <laughs> i guess i'm not can't really think because i'm hungry so i hope um if you have any questions or comments um comment of course rate favorite all that good stuff and if you got any questions you know put a comment and if you don't want to do that send me a message you know and i'll try to help you if you got any requests, go ahead and request it. I don't know that much, but if you see anything, just request it. And the map that you saw earlier, I might release a preview of that. And eventually a, a wad download, but at the moment it's still in progress. So, Okay, so, you know, I hope that been formal or whatever. I can't think at the moment, so, you know, peace out. Thanks. After I finish out how to end this again.